Okay, hello Virgos. How are you doing? This is Heavenly Tarot. I'm doing a weekly read on you guys' energy. Seeing what's going on for you guys this week. Okay. Welcome to my new um, viewers. Anybody who stopped by to check out my channel. Welcome to my channel. I would love to have you. Please subscribe before you exit out. Thank you very much. Okay. And I hope you enjoy this read as well. You guys, it may resonate. It may not. If it doesn't, maybe next time. If it does, I hope it helps you be enlightened on the situation. Okay? All right. <clears throat> so, Virgos, what I'm seeing for you guys, what I'm picking up, is sticky situation. I'm hearing sticky situation. So, you may be in a sticky situation. Okay? Or going through a sticky situation as well and i'm here in spotify so i don't know if that's your favorite i had to look it up it's a radio station i don't know if somebody um makes music somebody may make music and their music is being put on spotify or is on spotify that's where they put they put their new music or um that's your favorite thing to go to to listen to music so i don't know all right so that's what i'm hearing spotify in sticky situation all right, and spontaneity, spontaneous. You're either needing or wanting spot spontaneity in your life, or you're wanting somebody spontaneous that can be spontaneous to you. You need that somebody that can, you know, be quick. Okay, somebody that you don't have to wait on. Okay, so I'm hearing spontaneous. I'm hearing Spotify and um sticky situations so either that's coming towards you a sticky situation is coming towards you or you're going through one or something is a sticky situation for you okay all right yeah you may have be having to work some type of situation out between someone okay all right so let's get started Okay, Holy Spirit, show us um, Virgo's energy for this week. Show us Virgo's energy for this week, Holy Spirit. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, your cards is popping out. Wow. Okay. Came out quick. Okay, these two laying over here. Okay, um, Virgo. Okay, so the energies that um, came out for you are the Four of Pentacles. Um, it may be a situation where you're hoarding money, or you may have to hoard money, or you don't want to let someone go, or some you don't want to let something go. Queen of Pentacles. Um, this is a Taurus. Okay, or this is a situation you may be discreet in or you worrying about how people look at you you're all about your worth in a situation okay you worry about how people look at you how the public sees you okay all right seven of cups options conflict confusions um bearing gifts to someone okay those are the three that seven of cups mean okay in your energy okay Four of Wands, um, enjoying life, having fun, traveling, um, marriage, engagement, all right? That's the Four of Wands, all right? Mm, it could be family gatherings, family coming to visit you, okay? Five of Pentacles, feeling out in the cold, feeling at a loss, feel, feeling impoverished in the situation. Two of Cups, commitment, partnership, okay? Seven of Pentacles. Um, deciding which way to go and grow. Who you may want to grow with. Okay. Mm, strength card. Leo. Or you being using your strength in the situation. 
Page of Swords. Somebody may have cut you off. You may have cut someone off. Or this is Gemini. A young Gemini. Or you want a new beginning. And, I mean, this is this is an air sign. It could be a Gemini, Aquarius, or um, Libra. Okay? This is an air sign card. Either sign. Eight of Swords. Um, feeling trapped. Feeling stuck. This could be confusion as well. Six of Swords. Um, you move into better waters with someone, or you just could be just moving to better waters. Chariot card, Cancer. You moving in with someone, someone moving in with you. You could have to travel for medical situa um, situations. Um, you could be moving to another state. Okay. Mm hmm. Yep. Aquarius card, success card, okay? You might be coming in some type of success, money, promotion, anything, okay? Or it's Aquarius in your energy, all right? Hope card, hope for the best. Okay, so four pinnacle. So what I'm saying for you, um, Virgo, is a situation where you you're not wanting to let a Taurus go. And you see this Taurus worth. Okay. Seven of Pentacles. This Taurus may have a lot of options. Or you may have a lot of options, but you want this Taurus, Virgo. You may have a lot of options, but this Taurus is the one that you want because you know their worth, okay? Okay, you're, you, you see yourself enjoying life with this Taurus. Okay, you're thinking of maybe being married to this Taurus as well. You see yourself having a family, the four wands, everything. Enjoying life with them. You know their worth. You have a lot of options, but that's who you want. Holy Spirit, clarify this four pinnacles. I'm going to clarify. Clarify this four pinnacles in Virgo's energy for this week. Clarify this four pinnacles, Holy Spirit. Too many cards. Clarify this four pinnacles. Okay, yeah, you don't want to let this Taurus go. You're up worrying, thinking about this Taurus, worrying about them all night because you don't want to let them go. You stay up all night worrying about them. Holy Spirit, clarify this Nine of Swords in Virgo's energy. Yeah, you're working hard at being able to build with this um, Taurus. Build a stability with this Taurus. You're working hard. Holy Spirit, clarify this Eight of Pentacles. One more card for that. Yeah. And you may have cancer in your chart, Virgo. You're trying to be rational in this situation. You're trying to contain yourself. You're trying to think rationally when it comes to this Taurus. Okay. Queen of Pentacles. Holy, let's clarify. Holy Spirit, clarify this Queen of Pentacles and Virgo's energy. Okay, you're giving more to this Taurus than you are anybody else. Okay, you want balance. Stability. You want to bring stability. Or you see this Taurus is bringing you stability in your life. You see this Taurus is having a windfall of money. Or maybe that's how this Taurus is seeing you. This Taurus is seeing you as having a windfall of money. Bringing stability to their life. Okay. 
So you have nothing to worry about, okay? There wasn't a victory with you as well. This Taurus wanting a victory with you as well. Holy Spirit. Yeah. Yep. They they see you as having options. Okay, you're seeing each other as enjoying life with each other. Yep. So let me see what this is about. The Five of Pentacles. Someone's feeling at a loss, feeling out in the cold. So maybe you're feeling out in the cold right now when it comes to this Taurus. Okay? But there wasn't a victory with you. They see you as having a windfall of money. They see as you giving them stability. But you're feeling out in the cold right now. So let's see why you're feeling out in the cold. You're feeling at a loss. Holy Spirit, clarify this Five of Pentacles. In Virgo's energy. Okay, so you're feeling at a loss in a situation with someone that you're married to. Okay, so you're married. You're feeling at a loss and you're thinking and strategizing and planning. Okay, when it comes to somebody that you're married to. Okay, so let's see what you're thinking about. Holy Spirit, clarify the um, Knight of Pentacles and Virgo's energy. If you're not married, you're in something long-term with someone. And they have you out in the cold. Holy Spirit, clarify the Knight of Pentacles and Virgo's energy. 